Hola from Mexico. Some of you know I am currently in lovely Cancun, Mexico for a way overdue mini vacation. This isn't really just a time for relaxation for me or a vacation for me. About 30 years ago, I met a man who was so inspirational to me. He had shared with me a life altering experience that he had. For him, it was very life altering and recommended that I do it. He had shared with me something that I've been waiting patiently for years, sometimes impatiently, where I thought it would never happen. Yesterday, after three decades of raising my family, struggling to make ends meet, taking care of everyone else, all of their needs, still believing, wishing, and hoping I achieved this dream. In Cancun, Mexico, I was able to spend the day swimming with the dolphins. It was one of the most enlightening experiences of my life, truly, to physically actually see and understand that we are all connected. I spent time with Camara, a 30-year-old mommy and her one-year-old son, Fred. <laughs> His name, Fred. Mommy gave me kisses on the cheek and the mouth while Fred was bumping into me with his rostrum, that is the nose, on my legs. He wanted to play with me and he kept bonking me. They are the most loving and docile creatures. Unless they're provoked, of course, or protecting their babies and they protect others. And some of you know this, they protect others in the sea. They have unconditional love. They exchange their loving. Uh, this energy that comes from the dolphins is very high vibration. They're very happy and you can feel it. And they exchange that with us. They look at you directly in the eye. They have eye contact. Fred, at one point I was standing standing there and I looked down and I saw Fred coming at me away from the other people he came at me his nose was at my feet and he shimmied up my body his tummy touched my tummy and when he got up he got in trouble by the trainer because he wasn't supposed to do that so I didn't get any kisses but wow his belly his body Lengthwise, going up mine was ugh, a unique experience. Their little unique personalities are so much like ours. I watched baby Fred as he was playing just like a child, and then he would run back to his mom and listen to the trainer, of course. It was an incredible experience to bond with Fred. In the end, both giving me a ride both mom and fred gave me a ride across the water which was incredibly uh, exhilarating okay i share my personal experiences with you to encourage you to never give up on your dreams i've had many of you say to me in person i can't do that it hasn't happened then it won't happen because i'm too old I'm too old to love. I'm too old to be in a new relationship. I'm too old to go traveling. I'm too old to make life changes. So I'm just gonna give up on my dreams. I am 56 years young, stronger and wiser than ever. It doesn't matter how young or old we are. What matters is that we believe in ourselves enough to know. If we want it, be diligent in your beliefs. Focus in the positive that it is going to come and it will happen when it's the right time for you. I wish everyone a wonderful weekend. I will be uh, uploading my videos very soon. I just wanted to take a moment and share this with you because I want to inspire you to never give up on your dreams. Te amo, and muchas gracias, México.